Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be doing a room tour. So, we'll start off with my bookcase. We have my Minecraft before. This is probably the only book I've ever loved. Like, I've liked a lot of books, but this is probably my favorite book ever. This is the only book that I will probably ever read. First of all, that I've read so far, but also that I will probably ever read. That made me cry. At the end, when you find out that the... Uh, I can't tell you. Spoiler alert. Here. Um, just uh, skip in the video if you don't want to know what happens. But if you've already read the book or you want to know what happens, uh, the dog dies at the end. So, yeah. That's the part that made me cry. But, uh, yeah, I have some bookmarks right there. Um, I have my Harry, a couple of my Harry Potter books. I have the whole series at my mom's house. Then I have my WWE magazines over here. Oh yeah, sports books right there, um, gaming books, and these are just like folders that have some things in them, and then those are just some random papers. Wait, this, I, is this what I want to, yeah, this is what I want to show you. This was from my fourth grade class, it's, um, it says Trey, and I won't say my last name, and then it says Italy. Since I'm partly Italian, we had to do, like, this thing. And we had to write, like, part of the cultures. And then did that, like, a little family tree. And my grandma wrote how to make chicken parm. Her chicken parm is amazing. Then she just gave us this. I really wish we could color this more, but she just told her to color the continent. I wish I could, like, make like, a color key, like, red equals that continent. So then I would color Europe red, and then the land would be a different color. Yeah, I wasn't too good at drawing. That's how I made my flag. Yeah. Um, then this is a printout of Italy. Then there's some pictures. That one... Got ripped a little bit. Uh, is those? Um, this is something about Christmas Eve, I guess. And that's it. Yeah, but I wanted to show you guys that. Um, I'm probably gonna post this video the day after because I just wanna upload one video a day so I'll probably post it tomorrow morning or I'll post it today I'm not decided yet I would just have some mini card binders right here um we have some uh what you call them uh, notebooks um so yeah I have some board games I have this this book couldn't fit with the rest because it's a WWE encyclopedia. I only have one other encyclopedia, and it's a dog encyclopedia. Yeah. So, yeah, I got some games. This game is the hardest game in the world. My dad has watched The Simpsons for, like... Um, like, ever since he was a kid, and he doesn't even know all of them. Like, only, like, people that have watched since day one and watch it every single episode over and over, nothing but The Simpsons, they might be pretty good at this game. But besides that, no. This game's hard. Let me have this... This is a um, 1989 whole entire baseball set. 
of every single player. And I just have some a sticker book and some more folders and stuff and some binders. But um yeah, that's it. This bookshelf right there. Then uh, I'm work I'm working on a rookie card binder and putting stickers, so I found a bunch of sports stickers. These are overdue library books. <coughs> I didn't say those were overdue library books. Who said that? Um, this is just some coins. And of course, I put cards in the ground. Yay. Okay. Um, this just has a bunch of random stuff in it. Um, this is just all packed with randomness. It's like a five dollar Amazon. It's like it still has like five dollars on it. The GameStop gift card. Um, got Amazing World of Gumball on. Um, like I said, I'm gonna give it to my brother. And my VR set. Problem is, you need a phone. My phone doesn't work. It got cracked. But yeah, uh, hockey cards. I'm not really that fond of hockey cards, but I got them for free. And they were like 1990 and 1991 team sets. Like every single team. So I was just like, okay. And then this has some more stuff. This is literally stuck. Watch. Look at it. It doesn't, it doesn't go in. So what I'm I don't know what's wrong with it. But this just has some more things in it, some rocks. None of this paper. Oh yeah. This thing. Which was a 1996 edition of Clifford Johnson with that and his card. Oh, there you are, kitty. Oh, here's my three-legged cat. He has three legs. He's from Crossy Road. I can show you the tag. That's why he has three legs. Um. Laundry, Pokemon cards in the ground because I was sorting them. Uh, those two boxes on the bottom are sports cards. The rest is just stuff. More stuff. Uh, sports cards. And this and this. Um, sports cards. Okay, this is where it gets really cool. Sports cards. Sports cards, sports cards, sports cards. Hold on, it's not done yet. Whew. Let's lift up all this. Sports cards, sports cards, Ooh. sports cards. Sports cards, sports cards, sports cards, sports cards, yep, and it's a very, very special thing, this is my Brett Favre Monday Night Football plaque, an original from 1995. This thing is worth a lot of money. Trust me, it's a lot of money. Yeah. Uh, there's that. My New York Giants Lucha Libre mask. Um, and then this is where it's... So I have my dad's trophies on this side. And my trophies. I have a Little League 2014. We actually this year make a uh, video just in itself about this. 
I won the championship. I'll do more about in that video. Uh, this was my last year football trophy for the 2006 team uh, Warriors. We got defeated in the semifinals by Brainford. Um, one thing about Brainford, um, rest in peace, Ben Callahan, he drowned in a river. So, yeah. This is a 2015 baseball trophy. Okay, yeah. This is, might be my favorite trophy. This might be f more just because it's a, my it's higher up on my list. It's actually my favorite sport. This sport is my third favorite overall. It's my second favorite to play. But this is my fourth grade, fifth grade, 2016 um, championship trophy. That game, I think we won. I'm positive we. I think we won 38-36. Right before the buzzer, the kids was about to shoot, and and then this is um my national youth award for. I did this uh, program at my elementary school, and you would help kids in like first grade. You could help at anything, so I chose first grade. Then they elected me. They wanted me to keep doing it. So I kept doing it, and then I got that award. Then these are my dad's trophies. Um, yeah, I really won't go into those. But, um, I guess that will be it for this video for now. Oh, wait, I want to show you this and another thing. So, like, I went to, with, um, WWE T-Slot, I went to, um, a Harlem Globetrotters game, and I got it signed by, um, don't even remember, but yeah, got that signed, and also my team photo for this year, I just wanted to show you that, and if you haven't noticed, Yankees, 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 and, uh keep forgetting that I have things, okay, then I also have this. This is from Derek Jeter's last game at Yankee Stadium. Last ever game. That's dirt from his last game. That's a picture of him when he hit his walk-off. So, yeah. But, that's going to be it for this video. So, bye, Yankees.